Hi, um, YouTube and social media or etc. This is probably a long video of my Target haul. I already showed what I, obviously I got my paper cut right here, which is just a phrase. Okay, whatever. But, um, but basically, um, I went and did my shopping at Target and I'm going to show you what I got. Some stuff I might have to refund if it didn't work out or not. But I, there's two bags, but there's actually four bags. Because there's one back here and another bag inside here. One back here and another bag inside here. So I'm going to show you what I got. Because I like doing hauls and I like watching hauls of stuff that people get. So I got me a Starbucks gift card for my older sister. She's turning 40. Wait, today is June 29th. I got my SSI check. Because usually on the first I get it. But I got it two days early, so today is the 29th, so I got it today. Usually I get it on the weekdays if it's going to be early, but it's on the weekend, so it's today's Saturday, so I got it. Sometimes I do get it on Saturday or on the weekends, but usually on the weekdays or on the first. But yeah, so I got this gift card. Gift card for my older sister. It's $15 too, so she can get her coffee or whatever. And it's Starbucks. So, at Starbucks, so that's my haul for this one. So I had to give it to her on her birthday. So that's like in the end of the month. So, so yeah, so this is her gift card. And I'll write it down right here when it says her birthday. Both to and from and then how much it is on, on the card. So this one I have to hold on until her birthday. I also got it a new nice pillow for my side because I feel like I need more oomph on my side I sleep on the ground which is where I'm sitting at right here but then um so yeah so I got me a pillow to put with these pillows right here so I'm putting it right here so this is the pillow right here my budget was about 200 it was actually 219 dollars or 220 dollars but I'm paying it with zip which is a four installment payment uh process kind of credit card type of ordeal where I pay the first payment first, and then the rest I can pay later. So, are you ready? I pay the first payment, and then I usually, every time I use Zip, which is like where I like to splurge online, or like on Amazon, or Walmart online, or shopping online, or etc. or, you know, clothing stores or whatever, like, or whatever. But then this time, this was my first time trying it, uh, using the Zip card. Which I, I think I showed in the when I was doing my shopping at Target. I used the physical zip card. I finally used it for the first time because I usually buy it does use the zip app online to buy all my stuff online. But this is my first time where I used it in person and I actually went to the Target store and used it. At first it declined because I didn't I was like, Oh, why does it you know like it declined and then I realized so I, I was like, Oh, can you put my stuff aside, you know, my shopping and then so I can try to check on the app, see what am I doing wrong or what I had to do. So then I looked in the app, I'll see it when I went where it says in store, so I had to click on that side of the section and then it says you have to write the total you have to type in the total and then I gotta confirm the total and then I can insert the card, the physical card, and then after that it will work and then I will be able to pay the first payment, which was my budget was the total for the whole shopping, which I usually do like about two hundred something dollars, so it was about two hundred seventeen dollars. But plus since it was in stores I had a fee of six dollars. So I didn't know that, so then it kinda of took away from my budget for my Uber. Right, so I had to use my money for my fifteen dollars for my food for Jersey. I had to take use that one to just use for my Uber, and then or the money for my fast food, I had to take out nine dollars for my, my Uber ride back home. So I wasn't able to get my Jersey mics, but it's whatever. So at least I was able to get some frat big coffee. Well, first I got me an ice a tea refresher. I think it was passion fruit. I don't really get the refreshers all the time, but I do like it sometimes, especially when it's like hot days. So I, I got it there first. I tried it. It was good, um, obviously. But then, um, then um, I got a, re a free refill, and then I got me an iced coffee. But I asked if I can put mocha, and they said that'll be a charge. So then I had to pay like some cents for that. But at least I didn't have to pay like four dollars, you know, for a medium drink of iced coffee. So I asked if I could put a mocha and some caramel. And then she put half and half cream, and then that was it was a good um, iced coffee, so I was able to get that. So it was only like ninety cents for a pre, you know, well, I meant a, a refill if I stayed in the lobby and you know, on premises. So I did that, and then well, that was after I finished my.
target shop. So I already showed this, got this pillow, oh. and my total was basically two hundred seventeen dollars. But then, uh, so I paid with zip. So then I already paid two payments. So it, the first payment was fifty six, <laughs> about fifty six dollars, and then I paid the second payment once I was at Starbucks. You know, because there's four payments for a zip. You know, kind of like a credit type card or online or whatever. So I paid the two. Uh, every time if I use zip or when I splurge on zip, it has to be around like two hundred ish dollars to, you know total to you know shop you know do my shopping spree so i basically took, paid two payments i always paid two payments on my first since i only get ssi my ssi check once a month so i at least try to pay two payments for the first month the second and third payment i try to pay at the same time as well on the next month so i'm gonna have to pay the other one in part so and then i got this this lamp so I got it this lamp. I'm gonna put it because we have a bulky kind of a little bit bigger lamp. So I'm gonna replace it with this lamp. And uh and I also got a light bulb. I'm trying to see if I and then I got it this mug. I wasn't sure to get this mug, but it was only five dollars. And I needed a mug for when I I put it downstairs in the cabinet where it's my side, my section, where it's my sugar packets, my spoons, forks, butter knife, my mug, and uh, coffee tumbler mug with the lid. So I'm, I'm going to replace this one that was actually a kitchen, you know, like my family's mug or whatever. So I'm going to replace it with actually my mug. So this is my mug. It's only $5. So I was like, I couldn't resist. I had to go get it. So it's wrapped up, etc. So there's that. So I have that. And I got this for the bathroom. <coughs> it's for um, anybody who has toothpaste, toothbrush or whatever or uh, we usually use a button knife to open our locked doors or whatever if it's locked and we can't open it or whatever or if it's you know a jam so i'll put you know, also a button knife in here too um for the bathroom so when we need to like open our doors upstairs we only have two rooms upstairs with the bathroom um in the middle so basically um our uh Older sister's mother-in-law, her room is on that side, and then our room is on this side. And then the bathroom is in between. So then this one will hold basically like anybody's toothpaste, toothbrush, and a butter knife, or etc. So I'm going to put this in the bathroom. So there's that. And so this bag is finished. And then I also got a bucket hat. See, I always wanted to get a bucket hat, but I can't seem, I think I have a small head and stuff that I can't seem to fit bucket hats or whatever, because I barely can see if I wear a bucket hat. So I, if I, this, if this bucket hat doesn't work, darn box, oh, oh, okay. okay, if this bucket hat doesn't work, I'm going to have to give it to my, my nephew, Osmoney. He usually likes a bucket hat, so I probably will give him this bucket hat so he can extra bucket hats or whatever. I'm trying to see if I can do it like this, but I can't. Like, like, see, look, it just look freaking dorky. I don't like that. So, I'll just, oh my gosh, freaking hair. <sighs> okay, so I got this bucket hair. If you can't see here or feel something, so basically, like, if I have a bad hair day or lots of days, whatever, um, or if my hair, if I cut my hair and I don't, you know, I'm still trying to keep it going or whatever. But I actually like putting it in the sun. So I can, you know, grow order. But if I don't want to, you know, show my hair, then I'll just wear my hats. I have a beanie actually, but I wanted to get another hat that's different from a beanie, so I got me this bucket hat. So I'll probably put some pins on here, or etc. So yeah. And then I got it some undergarments. This is for menstrual cycle. So it says there's that Hanes. I usually don't get um, undergarments at stores anymore. Because I'm right, I'm dead bottom, so I need it to be at least, you know, more than they usually play. don't have my size like so. But this one, I was like, let me see I if I understand. fit this I know I three extra large. But I'm usually like I'd say four, five extra large. I need I need it to be. But it was a hey, menstrual period uh, of undergarment, so I was like, I'm obviously going to need that when I'm on my period. So I got it this. So we'll see if that works. So, yeah. And then I got another one comment because I couldn't find anything else. I wanted ones where it's like a pop color, but I found this one and it was three extra large. It's undergarment. It's kind of like lace layer, but it's undergarment and we'll see. And it's also, it looks like it's big enough for me, so I'll get that. I have that. I have the light bulb. I have the light bulb for um, the lamp. So the lamp so right there. 
I try to get one that's the brightest light because I need the room to have like a lot of light. Then I try because I'm like low on trainer bras, so I'm glad I got me some more trainer bras. So hopefully these fit. So I needed to get one that's at least not too big, but not too big, big because I'm kind of I'm like I'm small, like I'm like small. I have small fronts, so I need it to be at least big enough for some fat or whatever. No, at least. So I need it to be like big, but not too big because when, and when it's too big it's like it makes the front part more than my hat so I'm, I'm, I'm small uh I have small front so I got it this one this one is a uh, extra large so we'll see if that fits if it doesn't fit then I can just refund it and then I got it this one I like pop the color and stuff and then this one and this one is like the man and his wife they have children to spare Daughters, and then, uh, I usually get trainer bras. I don't really wear bras. It kind of hurts my size when I wear wired bras and stuff. But so, yeah. And then I got it, two of these. Daddy, I'm a better than best on my history so it's like a gray uh, and a red one. Well. That's one of my girls. A gray and a red one. Right here. Here's the gray one. Oh, oh, back over there. I'm watching Horton here so that's also nudie. Uh, Dr. Seuss and Jim Carrey playing the elephant. Uh, okay. uh, so I got trainer bras right here, and this is a size. Let's see. This is a size large, but I'll see if it fit or not. And also, I got this glasses. I finally found me a glasses I think I like. It's kind of like a maroon dark red. Maroon dark red glasses. I need something like for when I go to town and then I'm walking and it's very bright in the sunshine. And so I got this. I kind of like it because I usually like these type of glasses. I wanted one that's not too small or too big, but I feel like this is probably kind of small. But it was only $15, so. So right there. And I like the color. I like the pop of color. And then, so yeah. So this is for like the sunshine or whatever. So I'll wear these glasses. So yeah. So that'll be cool. So glasses, right here. And then so I have that. And then I got it this rug for my side because I have a rug on this side. But I'm trying to see if I can change it to this one. It looks kind of small, and I want to see for my rug that I'm using right now. But I'm gonna to try to change it to this rug. It has some floral right here. It looks kind of small, actually. Now I think about it. But um, if it works, then it works. If it doesn't, then it will. I don't know. We'll see if I will change it or not. But uh, yeah, I think that's about it. Um, I got more stuff. I was actually going to get some snacks. I thought I had, I tried to calculate if I had enough for my budget, which was like $219. And I thought I had $15 enough for snacks. I didn't. But I was going to get Hot Cheetos, um, canister, you know, the Hot Cheeto ball type, um, you know, Asteroids type Hot Cheetos. And I was going to get some chips. So I was going to get me an ice cream. It was the... Valentine Someday, ice cream, gelatin or gel gelato ice cream, you know, Italian gelato or ice cream. You know, it was the salted caramel truffle. I like that, you know, that one ice cream. And then I was going to get, and there was actually, I was going to get this stuff for the broom where you, you know, hold the broom, the hook, you know, you hook it on the wall and it holds the broom or whatever. But I didn't have enough once I realized I was over budget, even with my snacks. So then there was that, and then I had to take out some other stuff that I wanted to get, but I was like, it was just more of a want than rather like a need. So I just got, well, some of the stuff I have wants obviously here, but some stuff is more like a need that I'm like, oh, you know, this would help, you know, like, etc. Oh, I forgot. I got this bracelet right here. So I'm trying to see if I can put it right here, and it says, be happy. So to remind me, because I do get, um, I overthink and stuff, so then to be happy. And it has a smiley face to move smile. So yeah, I'm thinking I'm putting it on this side, we'll see, but I might put it on this side. I do want to put a bracelet over here, but it keeps interfering when I put it on here, because this is the bulky part right here. So I don't know if I'm going to put it on this side, but I think I might put it on this side. I did want it to get some rings, but I didn't find any rings. And no one else can join. Unless they were funny hats. Not claustrophobic, but then when I'm trying to go to this, you know, bulky shopping cart, target shopping cart, trying to like look through like window shop or shop. And then, what's it called? So yeah, 
But yeah, it was a you know good experience. First time using the zip card in person instead of online. So that was awesome. And then I went to Starbucks after and after that I was gonna post a walk to Jersey Mike's close by. But I realized I needed money for Uber to come back to I mean to go to Uber. So I had to take away the shave off nine dollars to go to take the Uber back home, but first I went and got me a drink at Starbucks, and then I got a free refill, or somewhat a refill, for just 90 cents, um, which was the first was a refresher, fruity tea drink, and then the second one was the iced coffee with mocha and caramel, with half and half cream drink, and I drank that waiting for my Uber, and then I Ubered back home. So this is my haul, and yeah, so it was kind of a good, you know, like, I, I like doing my shopping today. Even though I was supposed to get long sleeve shirts at Target, I liked their long sleeve shirts at the men's section, but they didn't have any because it wasn't in season. It's summertime, so they were, were mostly like tank tops and stuff, and they didn't have any sweatpants. So I'll probably have to go to Old Navy or the mall. So probably next time, now that I can use, now that I know to use the zip card in person, but it has to be at one payment. If you do like separate payments, then you have to do that. That wouldn't work like for me. Like it would have to be one big payment, so that way I can just pay the first half, and then I usually pay two payments, not just one payment. I pay two payments because I only get paid once a check, once a month with my SSI check, so I paid two payments, well usually you could just pay one payment, and you just wait for the, to pay the next one later, but I have to pay at least two payments, so that way I can pay the third and fourth one for next month, because then that'll be later of the month, or later of the week, to pay it, so then also I can extend my later how to pay the next payment, because I have that uh, benefit or a perk, because I've been pay keeping up with my payments on zip, so I, I'm like, I like that, and my, my budget, my where I'm able to reach where I can do a, like a big payment is around like 600. I can also go up to even like a credit card, I can go up to like 900. But for now, it's like around 600 dollars that I can do like I can pay like a this much for, and then I just pay like you know four payments for a half, 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 half you know portion. So yeah, but yeah, it was a good shopping at Target. So that was my first time using the zip card, and then. And uh, I was supposed to get Jersey Max, but didn't. So I did got me some drinks at Starbucks. And then I went home. So I Uber, Uber back home. And yeah, so it was good to shop it. But then any stuff that doesn't work out, I'll just refund. So we'll, I'll see if I will want to refund or give it away. Or so, so yeah. Peace. Check out. Let's bring this meeting to order.